It's time for your happy hours. This is Bishop Larry D. Trotter, Sweet Holy Spirit Church of Chicago, Illinois. Um, as we get to the latter part of Psalm 27, it starts off, the Lord is my light, my salvation, whom shall I be, all of that. And you get to a certain point, and then the psalmist says, wait on the Lord and be of good courage. Wait, I say, on the Lord. He will strengthen out all of that. What do you do while you wait? What, what do you do while you're waiting on the Lord? And it's, I'm sure that there are, there's more than me that's waiting on the Lord to do some mammoth, large, enormous kind of things. But in the process of waiting, I was sharing with a friend of mine uh, last week that this 2020 has been a, a season of reconstruction. So I think part of why we're waiting is that we allow reconstruction to take its place. Everything that was not in place now comes to place. Everything that uh, seemed to be difficult, like it would, it, it maybe has to fizzle out. It's like getting a germ uh, out of a certain thing and, and cleaning it up for, for betterment. Mom would clean your sore with uh, peroxide or uh, mercuricone to get the impurities out. So maybe while we're waiting, we can decide to reconstruct rather than deconstruct. We don't need much more of time to purge if we don't get the lesson, we get the message. So while you're waiting, consider reconstruction. And the next, the next phase of reconstruction is that whole, that whole um, rehab people the rehab season of time, rehabilitation. Well, I, was, I was telling them uh, uh, other Tuesday about when I had my knee surgery and, and uh, after the knee surgery, here come Rita, poppy, poppy, poppy. And, and she's coming, I hated to hear her coming because it was painful to go through the rehabilitation. Bend that knee that now has got a, has got a metal knee in there and for that blood to flow, it was painful take my morphine shots and get ready to work out. And I would be working hard. And, and Rita would say, you can do it, Papa, you can do it. I want you to walk again. I want you to be able to tell the doctor that it won't work. The doctor told me uh, that you, uh, you will never be able to get on your knees again. And you will never skate again because you now have artificial knees. And I said, the devil is a lie. But it was difficult. First they did the reconstruction. Uh, uh, of the knee. Then there was rehabilitation of the knee. The exercise was painful. Some things while you're waiting are painful, but they are necessary to the process. So if any, any of you ever had a, a car accident or one of these things you've been dealing with, and you go to that rehab, and those physical therapy people, you know, they be telling you, do this and do this and do this and do this, and, you know, and you're using parts of your body you never use. But the benefits come later and be able to say that I reconstructed and then I was rehabilitated. But finally, I think also that while you're waiting, refresh. It's almost like on the computer times when you say, well, the computer been dead for a minute. So hit the refresh button so you can have a fresh screen. Come here, Isaiah, chapter 43. God said, I will do a new thing. Shall you not know it? I will make a way in your wilderness and rivers in your desert. And I will let you sing forth my praise. You are the people that I brought out of darkness into the marvelous light. So while you're waiting, reconstruction, rehabilitation, and then refreshing, renewing. I know in my sanctified soul that there's glory on the other side of this. But while you wait, use your time wisely. And the Lord, even our God, shall bless us. Wait on the Lord and be of good courage. And he shall strengthen thy heart. This is Bishop Larry D. Trotter, pastor of the Sweet Holy Spirit Church, 8621 South from South Chicago Avenue, where the table is spread and the feast of the Lord is going on. And I am still excited about your future. Be blessed.